Hey guys, welcome to Seattle Sonics basketball as we continue the start of our season. Um, how did things go? Well, death is starting to be an issue because of the hurt, the injury to Miles Bridges, and now we have an injury to uh, Jay Crowder. We had a three game losing streak before we got out of it versus the Spurs. Um, watch that game. Really pretty cool game. Very close. Um, we pulled it out in the end, and I don't know how we did it. Suggs had a big game, though. 30 points, five rebounds, four assists. Thompson with the double-double. Uh, Robin uh, Williams with the double-double. Um, so really good, pretty damn good game, despite our forward problem, because we are starting to have injury issues. Injuries are starting to affect us, man. Especially at the forward position. Something we definitely don't need. And um, we did have an injury to uh, Williams, who's now, he is a center, but he can play forward. I put him in the power forward position. He had an injury. And we had, of course, a few days off before we played the Barons, and he's back healthy. Because we would have been down all our forwards. Miles Bridges is out, and of course, Jay Crowder's out. I got Stevens in there, but he's a bench player. Not meant to be a starting power forward. So these are our starting power forwards, and they're out. And it's not good. Um, Crowder will be back in a little bit, but we got four or five or six more weeks until Miles Bridges is back in the lineup. Wait a minute. What did I do? I'm not used to these buttons. It's one thing about the Switch and any other console you go to, you're not used to the controls, you do stupid things. But besides that, um, I think we're pretty good. I mean, we did win against the Spurs and on the road, so maybe that bodes well for us. We can win these tough games, so it's not bad. We could be a, a lot worse off than what we actually are. But we're gonna do a two game, a two game, um, we're gonna do a two game series, two game video with the Baltimore Barons. We play them back to back. They of course went eighteen and sixty four last year, one of the worst records in the league last year. Um, got some really good pieces. They're six and five right now. Kevin Hoarder's on the team. Nurkic is on their team. Dante Patrick, Gary Trent Jr., Otto Porter, to Michael Green. So they got some pieces, man. They're pretty, they're pretty good. And right now, you know, right now they're six and five. They they started the season hot like we sort of did, and then they kind of dropped off. They were three and one. They lost a few games. They're still mid tier. Both. Expansion teams just trying to figure things out, man. Why does that say Bobcats? Not the Bobcats. We're the Sonics. Okay, good. So, even with our forwards being hurt, the season must go on. So, we're going to get into this game. This next two games with the Baltimore Barons to see how we do. I rested everybody for those two days. Um, they have a weird thing where they have your like training and practicing when you have big gaps between games. I let my players rest to keep down injuries because injuries are becoming a real big problem. We're going to get into this game between these two expansion teams. We're going to be quick. I'm going to do this first quarter and then we're going to, uh, Sim all the rest and see if there if there is actual games in the fourth quarter worth playing, and I think we'll we'll stick with that. I think we're we're fine with whatever uniforms we're wearing. We'll go back and start these games. Hopefully we can split. Hopefully we can win. Like go to and we can beat them both times, but um, at least get a split. It's early in the season. You just want to establish. I just need to see this team 
with the injuries how we're going to do. We can get past these injuries with a decent record. By the time, you know, Miles Bridges come back, I think we'll be really good, really solid. But that's, of course, with the added thing of thinking to yourself, well, we can't have any more injuries this bad, can we? Yeah, so far. So yes, we, we probably can. Hopefully not, though. Welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Yes, sir. Welcome everyone to the NBA Not desperate. Hey, this is the first. We haven't even gotten to 20 games yet, so there's a lot of season left. You just want to sort of just keep the wins, keep winning more than you lose. That's the main thing. I want to make the playoffs. Which, do I think this is a playoff team? With Miles Bridges, it's definitely a playoff team. There we go with Suggs. Cutting through. That's what he does. He played like a beast versus the Spurs, man. He was great. And that was a good slam right there. Cuts to the defense. Another thing I tried to focus on... While we before before this last video was definitely was definitely interior defense. You can kind of see it there. We train more for the interior defense, and we just don't give everything up in the middle. So far, so good for Seattle as we go jump onto a four nothing lead. And another thing, guys, if you do videos, this is very important for some. Odd reason, please double him, and they do. And you'll take that. I ah, hey, he made it. Hey, I'd rather give up that than have Nurkic beat me inside. We might be bad on the perimeter defensively because I more went into just like playing interior defense. Oh, there we go. Um. But yeah, a warning to anyone who uses OBS to record videos, do not, if it's working great, do not do the update. The update causes weird things, like right now I don't have volume, so I had to probably fix it, or I'll probably just leave OBS alone and stay in Streamlabs and just don't update Streamlabs, because Streamlabs actually has been uh, pretty good by me, and when I go, you can go live on it. And I never had any real problems out of uh, Streamlabs. Streamlabs actually is pretty good. OBS is good until I updated it, which I shouldn't have updated it. And Williams, I don't know. He's not a shooter. Mostly there for his defense. I really just don't have any answers as far as power forward right now. Power forward is pretty bad right now. Um, you're down two great players already. But we're playing good interior defense. I like that. We might give up some on the on the edge, but I just want to, we were just getting destroyed in the in the um in the interior. I just couldn't take it anymore. So I concentrated all our defensive stuff in the perimeter. In the uh interior. There you go, Williams. We do have Williams though. He makes a difference. <laughs> Uh, too wide open. Doesn't make it. Usually that would have been a shot. Ooh. And that's... Defense was tough on him, but he still got it in. Gotta love that. 
too many empty possessions. Right now, they need baskets. Oh, good defense right there by Eldon James. Run it in there. And just wish he had more speed. He could have made him. Could have made it in one situation. Good by our uh, our rookie, Eldon James. He's played pretty good. I think one game he actually scored a lot of uh, scored a lot of points. I think he scored like thirty points in one of our games. Very good player, man. That you get from the draft. I will say this with the Wild and 2K20, I don't think the draft really gave me great players. I think mostly what I built on at the Wild. Looking, just looking back on it, was free agency. It wasn't the draft that made that team really good. It was free agency. I want more draft. I want more players in the draft. Oh, and that's just a good, hey, heads up play. We're tough in the interior a little bit better than we, when, when we used to be, though. So that's good to see. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And, and making a statement right away, letting them know they won't get any easy ones when he's around. Here is Williams. Get in there. Oh, Harris. Yes. On the wing up. Back to Trent. Pass to Melton. Play tough defense on him. Play tough defense on him. Yeah. By himself. James banks it. Eldon James. <laughs> I mean, he stays in front of ball handlers. Sometimes he gets heads in pick and roll by bigger players. But overall, yeah, it's a beat. Defensive gets it to go. And the touch Nurkic has inside. We love seeing him be aggressive. Look to get his shot from him. Now, here's Sharp. He's going to play on the No. Oh. Oh. Wow, who? Williams. Oh, yeah. 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 And we're going to put in everybody. Now, just, okay. Well, that's fixing itself now. Here's more. No, feeling it out a bit. Pass it to more. Now the five on the shot clock. Over James. Yeah, good. That's the break for the defense. We're back about Elvin James. Stevens right open over there. I don't know why he didn't pass it. Oh, not good. Now, here's Melton. Still getting one by offensively, not scoring yet for him. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Now, here's Hunt. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Now we're playing like Boo Boo again. We're playing like Boo Boo. Oh, come on, man. And we can't get rebounds. Not good. And they tied it up. Eh, it's a matchup between two expansion teams. Good pieces. I have good pieces. It's going to be a minute. Get in there. No. Be 
He is not good laying it up, man. He's he's just not really great at lay doing layups, man. He's good at getting to the basket, hitting wide open shots. That's about it. James, wide open. No. Still a rookie. Oh, yeah, and then um, if you guys. Uh, right, Williams is really good at the rebounds, man. Um, guys are on my Facebook page. And you got it there. You guys are on my Facebook page. I meant to put up a picture of uh, Demontre James as he, uh, as we beat the uh, Packers, you know, on a last second touchdown pass to him, to, to, from him to Brendan White. It was a cool picture. I wanted to have it on Facebook. But, of course, with Madden's many limitations, I just couldn't do it, which is kind of bad. Uh, we just can't get rebounds. Once again, remind me how crazy Madden is and my disappointment with it, even though it is good for team building. But. But I don't think none of it compares like Madden compares to like 2K and the show as far as team building. I think it's more realistic. It's it's just it's just better. It's just a better. I mean, Madden is just not good in franchise. It's some good pieces there that you can build on, but Madden, as far as franchise, has just too many limitations to it. Um, this the, this game has a lot of stuff to it. You can get in there, Suggs, and he does. He does. And I love the way we're playing. And I bet all our backups are in. Their backups are probably all in, too, anyway. Oh, they're substituting Otto Porter's in there. And I like how the bench is actually playing these last few games. They play better defensively, too. Burke with the shot. No. You don't see that very well. And they fouled him. If you're going to foul him, at least make him not make, have him make the shot. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. You know, the versatility of Porter is huge. I mean, he's an outstanding defender. In addition, also, to be an improved scorer. Time for that side. Here's Stephens. Nothing out of the scoreboard for him. Oh. Ah, uh, you're going to jack up the Here's shot. The scoreboard is off the mark. And so it's Porter bringing it up now for the Bears. Now the pass to Trent. No, it's just no. Nah, Tudor is just not good defensively. Yeah, that's not. Just not good defensively. Yeah, better Come on, man. Oh, you're gonna jack up a shot too. Ah, but it worked out. Took it in his own hands. Pretty close first quarter. Ah, man. Y'all just let Otto Porter get at y'all, man. Not a good start. As far as I just said, the bench plays great defensively. Uh, they did. They did the last couple games I watched them. This is terrible. 
There's 47 seconds left here in the opening quarter. Six on the shot clock. Burke. No. Tip in by Thompson. Look, Thompson's getting after the highly skilled offensive rebound. He crashes with power. Releases. And the rebound goes to Mark. Yes, sir. He's a little bit in this corner. Seven of the shots. He'd be better off passing it. Yo, good job. Thought I was gonna, was gonna do something stupid. Yeah, actually did good. All right. Seattle ahead. They're up by one. And we'll be back right after this. And I like how we play defense in the interior. And some reaction as we get back to the game that's been pretty much here so far. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Seattle. All right. Yeah, I know what I'm about to do. Um, we're going to make it just four quarter games. See how the four quarter goes. And if it's a close game, we will watch the last four, five, four minutes of the game. And right now, nope. It's about to say we're pulling away with a big lead. It's a close team. Very close. Very similar. Very similar builds. Um, wow, what a lead. What a lead. Will it be a game in the fourth quarter? That's what we're wondering. Getting into it. And we are leading really well. We're going to get this first game. Are we? We lead by five with three minutes to go. I probably might just go ahead and just keep simming. I'll slow it down a little bit in case something happens. Oh, okay, we're up 90, 10 points. Slow it down a bit. We're gonna come away with our with another win. It's gonna be our second win in a row. Being down, the guys were down, that's pretty good. And what a way to end it. Win 96 to 89 on our home floor. We'll look at the box scores real quick. Suggs, 18 5, one steal, one block. One or two from three. Three or four from the free throw line, 7 15. And two door with 16 points, two assist, two rebounds. Surprisingly, really good game by him. Eldon James, shots weren't really going down for him. Three or nine. 11.7 rebounds, so he did it good on the rebounds. Thompson, 11 and a 9. 9 rebounds, pretty good from underneath the basket. Trey Burke, 10 points, 3, uh, three steals, 4 and 9, pretty good. Robin Williams, Robert Williams, my bad. 12 rebounds, man, that's what I really look for him to get me the rebounds. Trey Mann had 8 points in the limited time he played. Cody Martin, pretty good. Suggs with the win. Suggs with the game, though. Barons, Harder, 18-2. Nurkic, 17 points with seven rebounds. 12-12 for uh, Dante Patrick. And we take the first game. We take the first game. So where we're at. First quarter, pretty even. Then we pulled away in the second quarter. Third quarter, we outscored him 25 to 12 in the in the third quarter. That is amazing. Fourth quarter, they won the fourth quarter, but they couldn't overcome that third quarter, man. That third quarter killed. We killed them in the third quarter. Total game, you look at it, fast break points, points in paint, even, second chance points, bench points, we outscored their bench. 55 to 26. Defensive rebound wedge went to us. Team fouls. Biggest lead, 18. Really good win, man. 
Can't got complain about that. That was a good win by the Sonics. Now we got to go on the road to play the Barons again. I wonder if I should rest these guys before that game. They did pretty good. Should I rest them? Give everybody a rest? Before that game, I'm going to award everybody. This might be a stupid idea. I'm going to give everybody a rest before we head on the road to play the Barons again. This might come back to bite me, but we'll just have to see. What's the media saying? Media's not talking about us too much. Six and four. Um, let's check the game plan, see if everybody how everybody's doing. Suggs, Williams. Should I put Tudor in there over Harris? Since he's hot. Or should I keep it the same? I'm going to keep it the same right now. I don't know how Harris is doing. I don't know how Harris is doing. How are you doing that last game? He had two points, two rebounds, five assists. I don't know. Maybe I should try something different. We're going to give uh, Tador some time. But we're not going to give him the minutes. We're just going to put him in the starting lineup for now. We're just going to move players only. Harris will play majority of the time. But we'll give uh, him some time at the starting lineup position. Just see how things go. Just see how things go. We're going to do this next game. We'll sim it. We're not going to stay watching the whole game. I want this to go kind of quick. We did not practice. And I got Tordura in there. I gave less minutes to Gary. I gave more minutes. Well, I didn't give more minutes. I just put him in the start rotation. We'll see how things go. Uh, we'll go to fast. We will... Start simulating. We'll kind of make this a little bit faster. We'll slow it down here. Close game. Close game. We'll slow it down a little bit. And they got a lead. Oh, man. Let's jump in. We had to lead for a minute. We felt pretty good, and then we're starting to slide. Oh, man. No time left. I just, maybe we might come back, but we're down six with uh, four minutes and 29 seconds to go. Of course, I had to do this. Rebound, no. You know, guys, you can tell he wants to contribute more, but his teammates have picked up the slack from him. That's what the being on the team is all Get in there. Burt. Then there's Tristan Thompson, then it's Gary Harris, and it's Martin in the first one. Where's Williams? Please don't tell me he's hurt. Suggs, not really good defensively. That's where you pay for it. Still deep in some focus here in the second half, giving up way too much show. Here's Burke. Burke. Oh! 
he's been off tonight, off his game. At this point, he might want to focus on creating. Yep. Yeah. Oh, got the steal. No. Here's your back. Shot clock at six. Running to the basket. And it's Martin with the rebound. What's Martin doing in here? You'd like him to be better out there because he's capable of being better. I'm sure it would make things a lot easier, too. Here's Burke. Pass to Suggs. Suggs! No! He's been off this whole period. Unable to sustain any kind of consistency. Nope, not his game. And no, without Williams, it's, it's bad. He knew exactly where his man was going to be. Outstanding defense. There's just a lot of money in the lanes to the rim here. That'll drive your coach nuts. And, you know, I think he's going to tell him simply, we have to show and more fight on the interior. That's the top priority right now. But what an unbelievable offensive performance from him tonight. I mean, it's been crazy to watch him just go off. Can they tell me who's like not in the why the I mean, my guys are not in the game? I don't know. We'll figure out later. I mean, the defense had no chance. He just kept and we come over back and over again. Oh, he's a crowd favorite. This building is never over. Oh. He's at his best. He's at his best tonight. He had this place going crazy. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Oh, man. We're getting beat. There's Williams. We can do this. This is why we put in the work. This is the moment. The work pays off. He's coaching up for victory. Great work, Allie. Thanks. Jador, no. Oh. I think it's over. I think it's over. We will simulate and we lose. We get the split. Thought we were going to win the way it was looking, but man. Nurkic, Nora, Melton. What happened, man? 14 points for uh, Eldon James led all our scores. That's not good. Williams, 14-5, 13-3 for uh, Suggs. He was off. Burke. What did Turdur do? He was all right. I think I better put Harris back in where he was. <laughs> I don't think that had anything to do with why we lost the game. We lost the game because we just got beaten in the interior. Something that we sh haven't done in the last few games. Let's see. First quarter, they won it. We won the second quarter. Third quarter, pretty even. Fourth quarter, yeah, they pulled away. Total game. Free throws. They got to the free throw line a lot. Fast break points. Points in paint. We got killed there. Second chance points. Yeah, we didn't deserve to win. But we split. I can't really be too... At least we didn't lose both games. That would have been bad. <laughs> we didn't lose both games, so that's good, you know. Clearly, uh, defensively, uh, we just didn't have it that game. But we did split. We will practice for the Warriors, of course. Where's, what's the Warriors' record? Nine and four. They got to come to our place, though. I still don't like it. <laughs> we got to play the Warriors. Who we'll shoot very well in the perimeter. And they're nine and four, and they shoot very well in the perimeter. That's probably not going to be good for us. Or his injury. 
I really need Jay Crowder back. He is day to day. He is day to day though. So that is good. We can probably have Jay Crowder back in a couple of games. So I really need him. And Tador, I like you, but you're going to be back where you were. We'll put Harris back in the top. We'll players only. Probably give you Tador, give him less minutes. Give you a little bit more minutes. Give you 20. He'll be down to 20. Give him some minutes. Thomas. Let's see. Add more minutes to uh, Thomas. Give him about 10 more minutes. Snell. Yeah, we'll keep Snell where he's at. Keep everything where it's at right now. Hey, we got the split. Not bad. Not bad. Could have been worse. Look at Luke's standings right now. I didn't tell you to do that. Ah, oh, these buttons, man. Luke's standings. Out west. Not bad. We're six and five. Teams are under 500. Start of the season. Pretty good. The Oklahoma City Thunder. 10 and 4. So I know Global Center. You got to say Gilgis. Of course. He helps out a lot. They got Mitchell Robinson. Not a bad team. Not a bad team. So they're not there. Minnesota Timberwolves are up there too. They rank two. Buddy Hill, D'Angelo Russell, Skoji. Rodney McCowns, Taurus, Colver, Monte Green, Gold State Warriors, Jordan Poole, Clay Thompson, Andrew Wiggins, they don't have Steph Curry? Oh yeah, of course they do. <laughs> He's the MVP of the league, they're not going to get rid of him. Pelicans, they're a pretty damn good team. Jazz, yep. Grizzlies, John Morant, Dylan Brooks, and then us. We're not far. We got to take on the Golden State Warriors, though. And that's going to be interesting. Not a bit, not going to do a video on that, of course. Don't know what I'm going to do in my next video. I want to try to get as far in this season as possible. I don't want to do just any game. Wild could be a game we might do. Highlighting these expansion teams. They're three and nine, though. So I kind of don't want to do that. We'll just have to see. Not going to do the Golden State Warriors. Pistons might be interesting. How bad they are. It's 6-6 six and six right now. That might be an interesting game. Lakers, always interesting. Uh, Force might be interesting. Who knows? But we split, we split with the Barons. So, hey, not bad. Could have been worse. Um, just hoping that Jay Crowder comes back. Would y'all – were Jay Crowder back? I think we might stand a chance of, uh, you know, winning some games until we get, um, until we get, um, Miles Bridges back. We'll just have to see. All right, guys, this is a lazy video. I kind of want to just get a, get a, get a video in, but it was a pretty good game. That glass first game is pretty good. Just got to see how things go. Want to keep the season going. Let y'all know what's going on. Going to kind of, kind of go more forward. 
as it goes on and not spend too much time want to, to the start of the season. Kind of want to get it to the middle of the season pretty quickly. Probably do it in the next couple of weeks. All right, guys. See you later. Peace.